The Chief Justice says that journalists are going to be able to access the information about what is happening in the courts via all the channels that have been provided. Now, this was stated in a press conference after the launch of the Human Rights and Judicial Reporting Training Program for journalists. The issue of access to information in courts has continued to be a challenge for many journalists, where the law requires them to first write to the court requesting for an appointment, but sometimes they are delayed in getting a response which hinders getting information on the court decisions. Now, the Chief Justice, Dr. Nezliayo, say that the issue had been resolved so that even the judiciary would have an interest in announcing the decisions taken in the courts. We have asked the Supreme Court to help them get the information because there are many times when a journalist wants to report on a decision made by a court, but you can't get a verdict. We want the decision to be made even if the decision is in the courts. But the Supreme Court's judiciary also gives the presidents of the courts the right to share information. Now, the issue of overcrowding in prisons was also raised in the presser where the Senate Committee on Social Affairs and Human Rights this Tuesday pointed out that the prisons are overcrowded. Here, the Chief Justice said that the proposed sanctions will be able to address this issue. There are other forms of punishment, but also with the order of the Minister of Justice, which stipulates that when people are prosecuted, they will be dressed in brass and then prosecuted where they are. There are also alternative penalties provided for, all of which must be enforced.